right hi guys welcome back to my channel so right now it is monday it's my prep time i just like basically finished my day because my prep is right at the end of the day the last period the last block um so i figured i would just come on here show you my outfit for today and then do a little what's in my bag uh, my work bag i'm also making a tiktok for what's in my work bag so if you see me looking down here that's where my phone is i haven't made a tiktok in a while so hopefully this is in frame the hard part is that i wrote um i put like a little sticky note on my door that says i'm in a meeting so that nobody walks in right now but i honestly finished everything that i had to do with my day so after this i'm just gonna go breathe and enjoy my life but let's make this tiktok Okay, so I just got this bag for Valentine's Day. It's a Marc Jacobs large tote. And so I figured I would do a what's in my work bag. So I have my laptop case because I normally keep my laptop in my bag, obviously. I also have my iPad and Apple Pencil. I have a bunch of random miscellaneous mail anything important on there hopefully not um i have this like mini lesson planning sheet um i got this from hello literacy like my first year of teaching in my work bag i also keep my purse so i just have like this purse at this moment i have in this bag an apple that i completely forgot about how typical a teacher to have an apple, but I'm actually gonna eat that because my head hurts. I have a hair clip, my iPad charger, a pencil case because I don't like to have like random miscellaneous pens and stuff out. This really just has pens and highlighters in it just because I don't want them to bleed. I have a PD book. It's the art and science of teaching primary reading. I have a book study tomorrow, so I was just reading some chapters of that. I have a little notebook that a coworker got me for Secret Santa. It's from like the Tabitha Brown collection. It came in a pack of three. And then in the little side pockets, I have some ibuprofen. I have some hand sanitizer some chapstick and some body spray don't ja don't drag me because i love the body fantasies body spray like honestly she's cheap but she gets the job done so yeah that's what's in my bag all right so let's get into this ootd i got this shirt from five below it says loving my curls literally says feeling my curls but that's fine and then these pants i got from sheen they're like little splits the shoes are Air Force Ones, and then my hair, this hairstyle is like, I'm kind of living for it. I hated it when it was wet. And then I got these earrings from Forever 21 in Phoenix. All right, so it is five o'clock now. Um, it's been a couple of hours since that last clip. I just got to the gym. My Planet Fitness is getting like new equipment and they're going through like a little revamp so they were closed this morning closing on a monday seems a little chaotic but they were closed this morning and they just reopened again <coughs> right now at five so um against everything that i believe in i'm going to the gym at 5 p.m um there's just a lot going on for me right now. So first of all, I had a monster today because usually, obviously, I have free workout. But because I didn't go to the gym, I got a monster. I got two monsters. One was for tomorrow just because I don't usually have time to stop and get energy drinks in the morning. So I was, you know, trying to help out future Karina. So I drank my monster in the morning. It was whatever. I also got a juice. I opened my fridge in my room to get my juice out. And my second monster fell out and busted open. Like, so there was a slit on the side, um, so I had a decision to make, and I made the wrong one. I was either going to throw it away or I was going to drink it. Mm. I had two monsters today. Um, nauseous is an understatement. I feel it just sitting here. It feels like a, a hiccup mixed with, like, acid reflux. It's so bad. 
Um, mm, so I'm trying to get past this feeling right now because I do need to work out. Um, secondly, I washed my face makeup off with just like some like what is that dr broner's like that's usually what i use to wash my face and i forgot to put a moisturizer on so my face is like hella dry and then third thing i am in a pissy mood for reasons that don't need to be put on the internet um and somewhere in the last four years i developed this like thing where i can't work out when i'm mad like i've always been the type of person when i'm mad i just can't eat like i don't have an appetite i don't care how hungry i've been no appetite because i'm hot and i just like started acting like that with my workouts like if i'm in a bad mood i can't work out and i hate that for me because i've always been the workout no matter what type of girl bad mood your mood will get better good mood you're already having a great day like i've always been that girl so despite my bad mood i'm gonna come in to this gym and i'm gonna burn like 500 calories because and then i'm gonna go about my night because i moved my office out of that like second third bedroom and into now the corner of my living room so we're gonna need to reorganize that little situation and hopefully this workout puts me in a better mood because i'm not in a good mood all right let me go it seems like there's a lot of people here i hate this all right, so I'm at Target because I walked into the gym and they said the cardio stuff was not going to be ready for like at least an hour and a half to two hours. No. Especially how I feel right now, like I could not just jump into a, a lift. Like I need to sweat some of this pre-workout or this monster out. So we'll see if I make it back, honestly. I'm really going to try. I'm re I really am. But I'm at Target right now. I'm getting some medicine and some tea i feel like i want to get immunity support because you know autoimmune but like calm and content is speaking to me i just love chai tea in general i also really love mint tea in popular opinion i know a lot of people hate mint flavored tea i don't know the options they're endless stress relief need that detox do i want to be in the bathroom positive energy Ugh, i'm probably gonna end up getting like four boxes to be honest yeah okay so i got the immunity support and the ease and soothe one but also this like dessert one vanilla bean macaron mm, that looks delicious Ugh, i think i'm probably good with these yeah probably good I think I'm also going to get some frozen fruit to, like, probably make a smoothie with. Alright, so, I just got home, and the gym does not open for another hour, but I just know I am not going back out the house. Like, I'm just not. So, I'm in my apartment gym right now. It's freezing cold in here, but I like literally have all my stuff with me. Even the stuff I just got from Target. Like, did not even go into my apartment because at this point, once again, if I go in, I'm not leaving. So I'm just gonna get quick two miles in and call it a day because I've never been more done than I am done with this day. This is my OOTD mirror, sick, disgusting. Um, I'm just wearing like a black shirt, my Gymshark Flex leggings in gray, and then my 270s. So let's hurry up and get this over with. I saw this idea on TikTok a few days ago and in my last vlog 
when I went to Walmart and was like looking at all this stationary stuff, I ended up grabbing these post-it notes to make this and then I moved my desk downstairs. So I was kind of just waiting to put them up until I knew exactly where they were going. But my goal is gonna be 50 pounds and that's gonna bring me to around 178. Um, good morning. It's 11.30, it's barely morning. Um, it is Tuesday and I'm in the car. I'm not doing so well. I don't know if you can really see it. You probably can't. I'll put some pictures right here, but I had an allergic reaction this morning to a medication that I started taking last night for my sinuses and it's all bad. Like my arms are completely inflamed. My face is like red. Once again, you can't really see it, but my cheeks right here, it's all like very tender to the touch. Also this morning when I woke up, like my lips were swollen. They're not that bad anymore, but I'm already like not a Tuesday girl, but this, this takes the cake. I don't even think that I said it in the last clip, but I'm on the way to the doctors. <laughs> so tomorrow I was supposed to have a checkup, like one of my routine checkups for my sinus. And because he's the one that prescribed me the medicine that I'm allergic to, I messaged them and I was like, can you see me today instead of tomorrow? Cause I'm dying. And I know you really can't tell. Like, it's not that aggressive, but me knowing my face. Like, I know my lips are swollen. Like, my top lip especially. So, I'm gonna go in right now. It's like 11.53. I'm early. But, what the heck? Like, listen, it's not one thing, it's another. And I'm just in the mood for a big, fat, juicy smoothie. So... I think I'm gonna get some fruit and stuff after this, but my arms hurt so bad. Okay, so I just left the doctors, and of course, they said everything that I already knew. Um, it was allergic reaction, they gave me medicine, whatever. I needed to stop at Walmart and got this huge bag of fruit because I am like craving something to drink. Um, one of my kids also got me a Starbucks gift card for Valentine's Day, so. I'm just popping in the Starbucks drive through line. And then I'm probably going to head to Panera for some lunch. I need to get gas, but like, am I going to make it? If I make it to Panera without getting gas, then I'm not getting gas. There, I said it. Because too much work, too little energy. And now they're talking about remote learning tomorrow because it's supposed to snow. Again, no. Love is so kind, it feels like 